Leanne Rhymes' hit song, Nothing About Love Makes Sense. And behind every huge single are the songwriters who put it down on paper first. Joining us today, the man behind that song, Nashville Songwriter Hall of Fame member Gary Burr, and his wife, a hit songwriter herself, Georgia Middleman. And they have a very special show coming up this week at the Cutting Room on 32nd Street. It's called Nashville to New York, and we're so grateful you guys are here. Today. Oh, happy to be here. You guys have written for literally the biggest names in country music, Kenny Chesney, Reba McIntyre, Keith Urban. Tell us about this show on Tuesday, because this is a chance for people to really know the stories behind the songs. Okay. It's, it's in Nashville, we show up in cubicles, we write every day, <laughs> and then they get recorded by these amazing singers. And so basically, you hear these songs on the radio, but you don't know where they came from. So this show is us, it's Gary Burr, me, Marcus Hummon, and Maya Sharp playing the songs that you've heard on the radio, but getting the backstory and hearing us perform them. When you see something like Nothing About Love's Me, when you see that video and you hear Leanne Rhymes, that's your work. What does that feel like? <laughs> Yeah, it's never not a strange sensation. Oddly enough, I could hear five songs on the radio, and when, if the third song is my song, it never sounds like a real song. I, that's not like as good as the other ones because I, I wrote that one, but you know, I, apparently they're okay. And you're gonna play that one for us in a little bit. And, and Georgia, you wrote Keith Urban's number. It was number one. I'm in. When you hear him saying that it's on the radio, weird. yeah, I'm like, holy crap. <laughs> what do you think would surprise people the most about the process of writing a song? The process of writing a song, um, I, I think, I mean, it's a pretty magical thing with a blank sheet of paper and a pencil. Mm -hmm. You know, I still write with a pencil and paper. That shows me that I'm a hundred years old. <laughs> um, I, I think, I think what would probably surprise people the most is how quiet it is most of the time. Mm -hmm. You know, it's two or three people in a room staring off into space. And you guys were saying you sometimes haven't even met some of the yeah. hit, you know, the hit makers who record the songs after It's the weird because in Nashville there are all these levels of people that listen to your song and you hope they like it enough to pass it on and eventually get to the artist. So that's why when you get a song recorded where they actually hear it, the artist, mm -hmm. and they record it and it gets on the radio, you're like, holy crap. There I know, it is. I know. Now, I'm a huge country music lover. What do you think it is about country music that people love? What do I you think love about it? I, when I was 10 years old, I turned on the radio and I heard a country song and it told this amazing story and I thought, I want to learn how to do that. Thank you both so much for Thanks being for here. Us. Oh, glad to be here. We so appreciate it. And Nashville to New York is one night only on Tuesday at the Cutting Room again on East 32nd Street. We've posted ticket information on our website, cbsnewyork.com. And as we go to break, a preview of what you'll hear from Gary Burr and Georgia Middleman. This is CBS 2 News Sunday Morning. Like a cloud full of rain shouldn't hang in the sky Ice shouldn't burn or a bumblebee fly If you feel so happy, why do you cry? Oh, nothing about love makes sense Nothing about love is less than confusing You can win when you lose it Sad when you're falling I can't figure it out Nothing about Touch my heart when you hold my hand. Oh, nothing about love makes sense. Love doesn't come with a contract. I give you this, you give me that. It's scary business.
if you need 